Welcome back to our Cybersecurity Awareness Month series, where we are sharing the real stories you sent in to help others stay safe online. This week, we are discussing passwords. According to CISA, the Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Security Agency, a strong password is long, at least 16 characters, random, no birthdays, pet names, or patterns, and unique, used for one and only one account. Now, sure, that sounds great in theory, but the average person has well over 100 online accounts. So how do we follow these guidelines without taking up all the space in our brain? Enter the password manager. A password manager is an encrypted vault that creates, stores, and autofills passwords. You just have to remember one master password. Now, let's look at a few password-related stories submitted by our users. First, a story from Wendy with a great reminder about fake websites and how password managers could help you spot them. I don't have our payroll company's website saved in favorites, so I search for it every time I want to log in. I usually click the first link that pops up in the browser search results. One time when I did, it took me to what looked like the normal login screen, but my password didn't autofill. Upon inspection, this was a fake site trying to gather my login information. I was able to copy a link and share it with the payroll company, and it was later taken down. Nice catch, Wendy. Password managers often only fill in on the site you initially connected the password to. While a password not filling isn't always a sign of a fake website, it does warrant pausing and examining the site further before proceeding. Next, we have a great learning experience shared by Rebecca. My cybersecurity story has to do with struggling to remember passwords. Because of this, I used to set most of my passwords to similar things, sometimes even the same word. One time I was playing a massive online battle arena game, which I've been playing for a decade, and I made the silly mistake of sharing my account information and password with someone who I thought I trusted. Due to the similarities of my passwords, he ended up trying that same password for other sites, and he was able to access my very treasured information, and more importantly, had access to my money. This experience challenged my ego, because I've been online for so long, I never once assumed something so foolish could ever occur to someone like me, a gamer who is super technical and computer literate. I was baffled, but it was a learning experience for sure. And now I try to make sure none of my passwords are even remotely similar, because you never know what could happen. Thanks for sharing, Rebecca. This is a very relatable story, which highlights how many people think this cyber incident won't happen to me. No one is fully immune from cyber criminals' increasingly sneaky tactics. Remember, while implementing password best practices might seem like a nuisance, a few minutes setting up a password manager now could stop your company from being breached and save you time and money in the future. <laughs> 